more on YouTube. Thought I'd just uh, jump on quickly. It's going to be hopefully a short video, not too much rambling. But uh, I'm going to call this video what we are up against as self-employed gardeners. Um, probably not the best title, but it's something I hear everybody talk about. And it's stuff that people, you all would have come across it at some point. But uh, basically today I was on a job and there was a parcel delivery lady. She was a nice lady. Now, this isn't to flame her or to make a point. This is just basically to see, say, yeah, this happens all the time. And it probably happens to you lot a lot. Uh, but basically she come up and she asked her what areas I cover. And I says, well, I try and, basically I try and keep quite tight. And she was a bit too far out of the way for me. But the reason she was asking was that uh, her gardener, and they, these were her words, she, it's, he's ripping her off. Now, I don't like to talk about other people and, and other gardeners uh, because we've all got our own ways of doing it. People could watch me and think oh, I do it wrong or I charge too much or I charge too little. But at the end of the day, it's how I run my business and it's how this chap runs his business. So it's nothing to do with me, but throughout the conversation, uh, it's to, to look a bit sympathetic I started asking a few questions and uh, basically this chap uh, in her words where he started out where he was charging her £15 an hour and he'd be there for two hours now I don't to me that's cheap but that's it sounds to me like this chap was starting his business up I, I don't know I'm not going to sit here and fill the blanks and I'm just going to tell you what she said Basically, he used to be there for two hours and he charged me £15 an hour and he used to cut the grass. And now she's not happy because he's charging her £30. He's still charging her the £30, but he's only there for about an hour. That was her words. Now, like, to me, that's progression. It's this chap. Again, I'm, I'm not trying to fill the blanks in, but to me, if somebody... There is lawns I cut and I am there roughly an hour and I do charge them £30. There's lawns that I probably charge a lot less and I'm there a lot longer. But as I said, I'm sure out there, guys, you've got lawns that's that. And to me, that seemed fair. And I did ask her, I said, is he doing a bad job? Is he, what, what is the problem? And no, he's doing a good job. He's keeping it tidy. But in her words, she can do it herself and basically what summed it up and what she said that summed it up was I'm not on £30 an hour now it doesn't get me that does get me back up that comment does but again I'm not there to argue for somebody I don't know and I'm not there to argue with her but I did interject and say well look to I've not seen the lawn because she wanted me to quote for it you see but for me, I've not seen the law, and I did say this to her, so I don't know how much grass you've got. That, that could be a perfectly fair price. But it's that she will not get away from it, and this is what sealed the deal for her, and it's sealed the deal for this gardener, and I hope he isn't watching. I don't think he will be. Out of all the 17 subscribers, I don't think this chap is watching, uh, but if he works it out and he recognises the van and he works out the area in and this lady is sounding familiar unfortunately mate she's giving you your cards and i wholeheartedly can't understand where she's coming from it's in her eyes she's not on 30 pounds an hour this chap's doing a fair job he's been doing it for a number of years and she's going to get rid of him <laughs> so yeah I'd love to hear your opinion on this. This is why I'm putting this little video up. I'd love to see what your opinion on on this. Uh, again, flame this customer, don't flame this customer. I think she is a bit out of her order, maybe if she would speak to this chap. But the facts, what I got from this, is he's doing a good job. He turns up on time. He, he's he's not done anything wrong. She's not, she's not said anything to slag him off. It's purely because the price is charging it, she doesn't earn that herself. She's not alluded to that she's not getting value for money. She never said that. All she said was that she feels like she's being ripped off. So 
I'd love to hear your view on this. As you can see, the clouds are looking lovely. Uh, so the rest of the day is going to be interesting. But again, I'd love to hear your opinion on this. Yep, over and out.